The conversation about schools continues in the capital city. Thanks for joining us. I'm Sheena Loshudo. Providence Mayor Brett Smiley was out at one of his first community events as mayor today. Smiley invited community members, teachers, and other city residents to share concerns on the public school system. They met for a bit at the Juanita Sanchez complex in the city. 12 News reporter Joe Cortez joins us with what the new mayor is planning, and Joe, he's already looking ahead, right? That's right, Sheena. Right now, Providence Public Schools are under state control until 2024. Mayor Smiley said today he's looking forward to making the, that transition smooth with education being a top priority. Mayor Brett Smiley took his first steps in creating a new structure of education for the city of Providence. And the answer is, is that we can't do it alone. The government can't do it alone. Teachers and principals can't do it alone. We really need community support in order to effectuate change in our schools. On Saturday, dozens of community members, teachers, and other citizens voiced their concerns and comments on Providence Public Schools, while the mayor listened to a range of different topics. You know, there were so many things in the Johns Hopkins reports years ago uh, about what wasn't working that then. That's when the schools were in local control. And so what's really important to me is we don't just go back to doing what we were doing because that wasn't working either. In mid-December, the Providence Public School District announced the closure of two elementary schools by the end of the year. Many parents and teachers were looking for answers. I was heartbroken because it's the only neighborhood school in um, Washington Park, and I went to Broad Street School. So it's a neighborhood school, it's a family, it's a community. Um, so I was I was heartbroken. I was devastated. Is the school really crumbling enough to shut down? Could you tell me? at the meeting that we had in the middle of exactly. December, like we're crumbling and that we need to shut down because if we need to shut down, it's crumbling. Why are we open now? Mayor Smiley said although he does not have immediate answers to every question, he's hopeful these sessions will create new opportunities for the future. And right now, the mayor is working with the city council to create what they're calling a new stage of education. What are the problems that existed before that persist today or, or the things that are working today that we want to make sure to capture as we together come up with this new governance structure? Smiley said he's hopeful to have a new structure for Providence Public Schools when the turnaround is over. And today will be the first of many open event discussions to bring the community's voice back to center stage. Later tonight at 10, we'll hear more on how parents can get involved in the future of their children's education. Reporting in studio, Joe Cortez, 12 News.